Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Moon Dancer. How you guys doing? In this one, I'm actually going to talk about my traveling altar kit. And when I made this, it was just an old, uh, torn up jewelry box. Like, it honestly, it didn't look like it was gonna actually mount to anything. That's how bad it looked. <laughs> um, and this is it right here. Oh, I do have stuff in it. So, see, it says Moon Dancer. It's got a wolf's paw and a pinnacle up there in the corner. And like I said, this was literally just an old torn up jewelry box. I. I tore off all the outside of it, like the paper or whatever. It was like a, I think it was a god awful green. <laughs> and I sanded it down with the help of my husband. And I painted the inside like a purple glitter. Or, yeah. A, a glittery purple paint there you go and the mirror wasn't part of, wasn't in there so we added it uh, we actually had to stick let me see this there you go we actually had to put those in because it was just one big section that's actually just cardboard but you can't tell because it's painted and after I painted it I painted the outside black and of course Moon Dancer on top is in the same uh, glittery purple and the paw is a silver glitter and then the pinnacle is kind of like all different colors <laughs> all different colors glitter and as you can see I've already added a few things in there I've got some crystals and a little, it's actually a pocket knife, but it's what I'm going to use as anathema. And I've got a little notebook down at the bottom and a pen to kind of substitute as like a book of shadows type thing. And I got some black salts in there. There's not a whole lot in there right now. Um, I still got to add to it. So, I mean, that part's actually still kind of a work in progress. But uh, I wanted to actually go ahead and show you this. These are actually really super fun to make. Because if you're ever... You know, if you're ever traveling and you're going to be gone for, you know, several days and, you know, you're wanting to do some spell work or whatnot, this is perfect because, like, literally it's, you know, like a mini altar in a box. <laughs> and, you, you know, you can literally pack it with you. It can, can fit in a duffel bag, you know, things like that. And... I've seen um, others do it, 
and I was like, wow, like, I want to do that, I want to make one, and uh, just, just randomly, like, came across this jewelry box, and because, because I was, like, going to go out and, like, buy a box or something, or, like, like a chest type thing, but then, you know, randomly came across this box, and I was, you know, I was like, that's almost perfect, like, the only thing is, like, it's so tore up and, like, bleh, and, you know, then my husband suggested, you know, why don't you refurbish it, you know, take all that off and fix it up to your, you know, to your liking, and so, yeah, that's what we did, I would say he helped me, you know, with quite a bit of it, and I'm super pleased with it, you know, and if you haven't made one, I suggest you do. <laughs> I'm going to uh, show you a little slideshow video type thing of the before and after pictures. So let's watch that real quick. So that was the before and after pictures of my traveling altar kit and I hope you guys liked it and hope it you know gives you some ideas on you know making one if you haven't already and I'm really pleased with it like I said I still got some things to add but it's it's 90% there <laughs> so well, if you guys make one, I want to see them, so, and, uh, if you haven't been on Amino, all the communities I'm in, links will be below if you want to check them all out, come say hi, but I'll see you guys next time, I hope you have a great day, blessed be, and don't forget to dance under the moon. Superstitions, black cats and voodoo dolls I've got a premonition That girl's gonna make me fall